Hey guys, Tate from Florida here, and I'm down in South St. Petersburg, Florida, and I'm at the Pinellas Point Tokabaga Temple Indian Mound. Uh, they were Native Americans that lived in villages around Tampa Bay, dating to about 1000 AD. They lived near the water's edge where they subsisted or subsided on water, on, I'm sorry, on a wide variety of fish, shellfish, wild game, and a variety of plants. From upland areas. Spanish explorers described them as tall, well informed, muscular people with a high level of civilization based on linguistics. The Tokabaga language shares characteristics with tribes such as Greek, Chickasaw, and Seminole. So um, let's uh, check out this Indian mound here, real quick. There's a couple more uh, historic markers here. On a friendship-seeking expedition along Florida Indians, Fray Louis Cancer de Barbastro, Dominican friar, dedicated leader in teaching religion among American Indians, was lured to this mound and clubbed to his death June 26, 1549 by the Calusa Indians. So you can see the uh, mound here. And we're going to take a walk up here. There's a uh, stairway to get up to it. So now on top of the mound, you can, if I scan back, you can see how far came up about, I don't know, say maybe 30 feet. So I'm standing now on top of the Indian Mound. You can see down there the historic markers where we just were. So, this is in South St. Pete, Florida. This is near the Sunshine Skyway Bridge. Not too far away from it. I'm hoping I can get down this way. I'm, I'm going down the other side where it, it came up. Hoping that's coming out. It's getting uh, kind of dark out now. So, um, So, there's the... Indian Mound here in uh, South St. Petersburg, Florida. This is um, actually in a residential neighborhood. See, I'm coming off the mound here, and look, I'm, I'm actually out in a residential neighborhood. So I'm not going to give the location out of this. Um, this is an appreciation plaque from 1958 of somebody who donated money to help keep this intact. So I'm not going to give this location out, but I'm sure you can find it on the internet. And, uh, but if you happen to be in this area and you can find it, come check it out.